Hey guys, I've been doing a practice journal book for a few weeks now and today I did the page Sleep with the journal, describe the experience. I actually had the journal in my bed that night and I do everything that was in my dreams which is kind of chaotic because there was a lot of stuff. Uh, at first I drew a bird because in all my dreams I can fly and, and my dreams are always extremely colorful so I really love this bird. For the line art I used my Copic Multiliner brush and my Copic Multiliner 0.1. When I was finished with this bird, I drew kind of a sketchy landscape. On the bottom right you see a bottle of wine or whatever and some other alcohol because I dreamt of a weird party that night that I really didn't want to attend. And the party was kind of in the forest. And my whole room was in the forest. And my room was also kind of my living room. That's why you'll see a sofa coming up pretty soon. So I know this is extremely weird, but that's what I dream about at night. On this kind of shelf you see photo albums and a vase of flowers because I dreamt about decorating my room <laughs> and also I remember flipping through some old photo albums and decluttering photos. I really tried to improve my cross hatching in this piece because I'm really bad at line art and cross hatching and things like that but I really love the way it looks so I did my best. I actually kind of like how this tree turned out. Here you see the sofa coming up now. Yes, there is a sofa on a tree. And of course it has the same colors like my beautiful bird. This desk looks so amazing. I can't get over how wrong this desk looks. But it's okay, it's just a doodle. And on top of this desk is actually my hamster cage because I tried, I really, really tried to sleep, but my hamster was so loud. And so you can see her running in her wheel. In real life the cage is bigger than this. And there are more flowers. They're growing out of the tree. Pretty normal, right? And again my attempt to use cross hatching and things like that. And then I used my new job pastels 
It's the first time I've used them in this book. It worked quite well, but I'm still trying to figure out how to use them properly. And of course I drew some mountains because in almost all my dreams there are mountains. And the sunset. <laughs> And you do really get messy when you use chalk pastels. I'm not sure if I like that or not. And then I added some details with a white gel pen. And some butterflies and flies. And then I went over the font again because it was kind of faded. Then I went over it with some hairspray. I don't know yet if this worked. And here you can see the finished pages. And now I'll show you a quick flip through of all the pages I did so far. I guess I'm almost halfway through, but there are a lot of pages left. Let me know in the comments if you're interested in a flip through when I'm done. Also some of the artwork you see in there is not completely originally by me. I researched a lot about other Rectus journals, so some ideas might be copied and other drawings might be copied too. There are some other drawings that I might have seen on Pinterest or something like that, so not everything you see in there is completely originally by me. Some pages are halfway done. This one I did with nail polish. And that's it for now. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!